Now to the story of good neighbors continuing to help each other. Patty and Thurman Thomas, the two founders of the Thurman Thomas Family Foundation, are lending a helping hand to help in the recovery of this storm. As James Catato tells us, the foundation says they've raised nearly $20,000 in just a few hours to help those who need it most. Snow is still flying here in downtown Buffalo. Now, while the majority of the snow has stopped, the roads are still slick here on Main roadways. People are still shoveling out of their driveways and it's an all hands on deck effort by people in the city, community members and organizations to get them out. What do you, how do you have? It's another day of recovery for a snowstorm that rocked all of Western New York. It's been five days since the start of the blizzard and some people are still without full utilities. I just got electric back Saturday and they're still working on the heat. Addressing needs for the community health, opportunity and resiliency coalition started from the pandemic, but now it's going to be an everyday helping hand to the Buffalo community, especially for the recovery of the snowstorm between the snow hotline on Christmas Eve through this morning at 915. We've had 1200 calls to the newly made Buffalo Blizzard Facebook group, which has already gained 67,000 members. Even for emergency care, people are posting to Facebook first before even trying to keep going to call 911. The coalition is coming up with new ways to make sure everyone can stay safe when these natural disasters hit. But it's not just city or county officials. The Thurman Thomas Family Foundation wanted to get involved. You know, there's a lot of people that were able to enjoy a really nice Christmas just 20 minutes, 10 and 20 minutes away from where this all occurred. Um, you've got to You've got to feel for these people. Since they opened their recovery fundraiser for the storm, it's raised nearly $20,000. The QR code to donate is on your screen. They need us. And I, I, I would encourage people to steer away from just anything that goes against doing good. And there's one particular quote that really resonated with me and almost the hundred people in the meeting. I want to read it out to you at home. It said, thank you all so much love in our community. People power. We are the solutions we've been waiting for. While the county and the city of Buffalo are working as hard as they can to get these people shoveled out, it's the city of good neighbors that's also having a massive helping hand and helping people return to normal again. Reporting in downtown Buffalo, James Catato, 7 News.